let's get straight into it. Iman Shumpert has literally just responded to the bogus rumors of him impregnating some chick during a threesome with his wife Tiana Taylor, which she had already slammed, but now he's double slamming, pun intended. Ain't I nice? But anyway, he said, I tried to block this out to just play my game. Now that the game is over and due to me and my family publicizing our lives, I feel obligated to touch on this stupid ass story. So let's start here. My legal team is about to go at all blogs involved in curating this fake news. And trust me, them blogs don't have my kind of bread. I agree. Second, Albie is my friend, and I'm not gonna apologize for putting hard eyes under her picture as seeing my wife go through a pregnancy and blossom in motherhood. I can't help but to admire and enjoy every part of that process through IG to any woman I scroll past in that energy. Thirdly, it hurts that people that follow me strictly for Tiana updates came to my page to troll all cause she deleted her page. The fact that y'all think negative things in her energy reflect on me when I'm the one always supposed Supporting her leads me to ask y'all to unfollow me. If you don't see who I am by now, I don't need you having a piece of my mind or family. Notice the timing. Anytime something goes good for us, a rumor happens that Iman is so bogus and y'all go for it every time. This time I'm using the bread I work my ass off for to bury you mother effers legally. This will be so worth it. Middle finger up all 2019. Peace de la fortu pie, if I said that correctly. But anyway, if you missed the story, check our previous video on this channel. But he basically gave the basis of it in his response. And let's be honest here. The reason that folks even came to that conclusion is because Tiana let the world in on the fact that they be indulging in threesomes. And I still don't know why. Some things you gotta keep private because once you make it public, everybody knows. But as you guys can see, he is not playing right now, and he might seriously be suing some of these blogs. Thank God we didn't run with this story, I'm just saying. But what are y'all thinking? Leave your thoughts below, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel for more. Like and follow facebook.com slash pettyblog, and don't forget to hit that bell to join the notification gang. Pettyblog.com, signing off.